was in college, you know, I always thought Farm Bureau, it was, it was a big insurance company. I didn't know that there was a federation behind it that, that advocates for rural Arkansas and for that matter, even urban Arkansas. I'm originally from Stuttgart. I've grown up around agriculture my entire life. My dad is a ag lender there in Hazen, Arkansas. My mom's a school teacher. And so I uh, started probably 12, 13 years old putting in levee gates out on, out on farms, just kind of doing here and there things. And I got an opportunity to go work on a large rice farm there in Stuttgart, Arkansas. Took the opportunity and ended up really enjoying what I did out there. I went to the University of Arkansas and I got a, awarded another opportunity to go another year of college and do a master's degree and I kind of wanted to distinguish myself from, from everybody else entering the workforce and I got a job selling equipment, John Deere equipment out of England, Arkansas. I worked there for eight months selling John Deere equipment so I was kind of always in, in touch with the farmers which I know a lot of people in the area now. And then I left there and went, went to work at Riceland Foods there in Stuttgart. And it, I mean, it kind of all came full circle. I, did, I didn't think I was gonna come back to Stuttgart, but ended up being in Stuttgart. I worked there for about a year and a half and the job here at Arkansas Farm Bureau came about. And I, I didn't really understand what Farm Bureau did. I was like, I'm not, I'm not selling. He said, no, 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 that's, that's not what it is. Arkansas Corn and Grain Sorghum Board, I'm administrator of that, and administrator of the Arkansas Wheat Promotion Board and I'm the coordinator of the forestry division and the coordinator of the wheat and feed grains division here at Arkansas Farm Bureau. You know, it, it, it's rewarding because you get to be around, I guess, a rural lifestyle, coming from the small town that I've come from. And, you know, the, those people you really, you really begin to appreciate. You try to make those, those relationships there with those guys and the only way that you make those relationships is you go around and start talking to them. You get to know them, you get to know their families um, and that's that's kind of the rewarding part about it. You know, I've never been up in north central Arkansas and I had to go to Jasper this past year because of the chronic wasting disease outbreak. It, it's beautiful up there. The mountains, the scenery, the deer that you see, the, all the wildlife, everything. It's, it's beautiful and then you go to eastern Arkansas, you drive through Wilson it's, it's, it's pretty cool. Putting in levee gates when you're 12 years old, it's not the funnest thing. You'd rather go kick rocks or go out to the swimming pool or something. And it kind of instilled in me, um, you know, you better work hard for, for what you do. If I hit the lottery and I could do anything I wanted to do, I would probably, I would honestly, I'd, I'd, I'd farm. Uh, I think the extent of our land holdings are 40 acres there. And, there in Prairie County, so, and it's all timberland, so it's, that's, that's not gonna happen.